tonight we've traveled to Hollywood. They are honoring one of my favorite entertainers in the world, Carol Burnett. There's a lot of celebrities. Let's check it out. It's Mr. Voiceover. So what are some of the voiceovers you've oh. done? Uh, well, Yogi Bear, yeah, I am bull. Hey, Yogi. And I'm the voice of I'm cooking for Cocoa Puffs. I'm also, uh, all the voices. Hey, what's up, Doc? Occasionally I've done bugs. Hey, what's up, Orange County? It's me, Stephen Kramer Glickman from Big Time Rush. I love you. I'm a huge fan of Carol Burnett's. Uh, yes, we all are. And uh, I think next to us, we got Margaret O'Brien. You know, when you're walking on a red carpet, you you rub shoulders, you see a lot of people. But to walk in with legendary Oscar winning Margaret O'Brien, one of the few icons of the screen left. I can't wait to see Carol Burnett because she's my very favorite. Yes, mine too. I'm a big, big fan, and I would not have missed this. What's up, Orange County? <laughs> I'm really happy to. Oh, oh did you just? I want to kiss lamb chop. I think he oh used his tongue. Oh, <laughs> I'm getting attacked by lamb chop, and I love my Mallory Lewis. Woo. Oh, thank you oh. so much. Can I pet? Oh. Anybody that deserves to be celebrated is Carol. Carol. Great to be here in Alaska. Yes, it is. We are in Alaska, right? <laughs> she looks the same as when my favorite movie came out, E.T., oh, D. Wallace. Turn around, I'll kiss it now, honey. <laughs> now, you know, we are raising money. We need it. And I heard you were actually a teacher? Yes, in another life. I taught high school. Well, good. So, Cujo, The Howling, I'm trying to list all the movies. What's been going on with you lately? Anything fun? Oh, yeah. I have several movies coming out. I have one for sci-fi coming out. I have uh, one of the episodes of Hansel and Gretel. Oh, one wow. of the new that films. Was fun. Oh, it was so much fun. I got to play the witch. <laughs> I have got her blink, blink, Tabitha, Aaron Murphy. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Good. Well, you know what? Karma's a bitch back in 2010, right? You did oh, a movie? it's great. <laughs> we I do did. our research here at What's Up Orange County. It's a, it's a web series. So, oh, okay. yeah, it's, so you can still watch it. I heard about it. Karma's a <laughs> bitch. So, you're really happy to be here tonight for Carol, right? Oh, absolutely. Carol Burnett was my rival when I was a kid. We were on at the same time. Oh, hey, I am with Lou Wagner. You are becoming a big star already how are you doing fantastic how you doing good so I loved you in trouble with the curve you got some movies what's going on with you now oh just uh, just wrapped a Nickelodeon pilot called the Thundermans and I uh, just finished a movie called past the light so uh, looking forward to that coming out by Christmas time cool. it's gonna be great to see Carol Burnett you know I know Big oh girl. my gosh my mom I mean I grew up my mom just showed me like you know all the Carol Burnett shows and I remember the first skit I ever saw was the one scene um, I think it was the Gone with the Wind parody when she comes out with the curtain rod. Yeah, how great. So funny. We'll have a so great funny. time. You too. Thanks. Thank you. Thank Carol you. Burnett tonight. Isn't that Carol great? Burnett. Not only did I grow up with her, and I, I loved her on Broadway and, and Once Upon a Mattress. Once Upon a Mattress? Yeah. But, but the Carol Burnett show. But I studied singing with her. We were in class together with David Craig. Oh. It was so exciting being a fellow singing student with Carol. But I heard you have got a, like a stimulus package show going I on. have a stimulus package. <laughs> How funny. Well, you are so funny and it's cold tonight, but you're warming it up. Oh, thank you so much. I, yeah, yeah. So I'm doing this show at the John Lovitz. But more importantly, tonight we're honoring Carol Burnett, who is, of course, my comedy idol. Well, Shirley Carol Burnett, tonight, isn't this exciting? I want, are you, we want to honor you next? Oh, thank you. That would be very nice. And I think she has one grandchild, too. I heard 12 grandchildren. 12 grandchildren. Wow. All ages. Yeah. 12 grandchildren and none of them come to visit me. <laughs> Not one comes to visit. Oh, this guy's got anything you're working on or anything that you want to talk about? I have a new a book coming out about my life. We got to get the book. Yeah, it's coming out in April. You can tell them and what's the name of the book? And, uh, well, we, we haven't we decided haven't yet. There. We haven't decided yet. They've well, given Sydney me a few Washington. names, and I'm trying to figure out which one. It's hard. Yeah. They want to kind of catch you sometimes. I know. Yeah, exactly right. So I'm Are they working trying to get it. the scandal stuff out of the book? Well, we've got some action. The, 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 oh, yeah. The book's already done. You know, I read the book, and it's oh, it's well, very interesting. Come on down. <laughs> this is so woo. Have a good night. It's so great to meet Shirley Jones and her husband, Marty. Is it possible that I saw you on the Flying Nun last week? Yeah, you probably did. I was the Buffalo Buzzsaw. 
And I want to tell you, one of my favorite shows is Murder, She Wrote. I'm missing you on it. Thank you. Wait, where, listen, that was special. That worked with a special lady like the one we're honoring tonight. Carol Burnett tonight. Yeah, Carol, yeah speaking of a great actress, there's a great comedian. Yeah. She's so incredible. We do our research here at What's Up Orange County, and I actually heard that you here, are, of course, graduated Hollywood High, but were you discovered or something here? I was on the stage of Hollywood High School. We had a wonderful, wonderful uh, drama teacher, Mr. Melton, Dr. Jerry Melton. I heard you uh, might have went to Hollywood High, is that right? I did, I did. I graduated last year. Last year, uh, of course. Okay, a couple of years ago. Yeah, a couple uh, of years. Yeah, it was good. It was good. It was so fun. is that where you got this acting great talent from Hollywood High? Uh, Did they help you out? Uh, absolutely. It was, it was a good part for me. I mean, uh, it was like stepping into the fame school. It was on television at the time. And, oh. You know, I would go. I danced two hours a day. I did rehearsals with the musical. Had several leads. And the one year that I was here, it was an amazing trip. And then from there, I went on to... Uh, to the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Art, okay. so that served me well to move into an yes. academy. So, it's just so, so let's ask, how's the dancing? <laughs> Are uh, you keeping the dancing up? Well, yes. Yeah, so uh, He's that. going to do a dance for us right now. Okay, here we go. Wow, look at that! Look at that! Look so, at that! And see the sons of yep, Million Dollar Baby back in 2004, right? Yeah. Well, yep, you know. I remember. Hey. We got to raise money for the arts because we want to keep the arts in the schools. Absolutely, right? absolutely. Whatever we can do to give back, I, I, I performed here um, as a student and I performed here as a professional, and now to come back and, and just give back in whatever way I can, it's awesome. What, what, she asked what I'm drinking, and I'm drinking <laughs> Deborah Shelton, and they're blocking my shop. But we love everybody. They love what's up, Orange County. But you know what? We cannot block my favorite. <laughs> Kim Poirier is with me. Poirier. 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 Mad Men is what I'm thinking. I saw you. Yes. You just did Mad Men, right? Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. I did Mad Men and The X's, and we actually just wrapped. Um, it's a four-part DVD series called Hollywood's Insider Secrets, and I produced it, I hosted a segment, and I also acted in it. Now, what are you thinking of the weather? Now, where are you from originally? Canada. Oh, I was going to say, I thought you were from it's Canada. Cold. Oh, it's cold. I thought you were thinking Canada. It's warm here tonight for No, you, right? no, 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 no. It's cold. Even yeah. when I lived in Canada, I still found it was oh, very, okay. very cold. Well, this is the beautiful. Kim, boy, I'm gonna do my best to say her name over and over. So next time I get to see her on the red carpet, I got it down. All right. Well, have a good night. Thank Carol's you, here. You too. Carol, I know. Carol, we her. I love her. Oh, Carol. I love my Carol. I haven't seen you in a while. I only get 60 seconds, so I'm so excited you're being honored. Yes, I'm yes. excited too. You're an alumni. I heard you were like the editor or something of, of the, the Hollywood the High News. Yeah, I yeah, was. So we need to raise money for the yes, arts, don't we, Carol? Yes, because when I was here. Uh, 10th, 11th, 12th grade, I graduated from here. Uh, there was no performing arts program. Oh, okay, oh. well, you know what? I, I love writing, reading your books, and I heard you might have a new book coming out in a yes, few months. It's coming out in April. Oh, good. Well, you look so beautiful. And you know what? The cold, but with you, it's warm in here because you're beautiful. The one and only Carol Burnett. I am honored to present the inaugural Carol Burnett Award of Distinction to my first inspiration and one of the world's greatest treasures, Hollywood High's alumna, Carol Burnett! by my high school because uh, um, I, I know it's hard to believe I was a nerd <laughs> and you guys are just sensational I wish I was home I wish I was back there but the things have been known And all that jazz I'm gonna 
Sweetheart, I love you. Thank you. Right.